Hi, it's Nico90. Welcome back with another Sonic X figure review. Today we will be reviewing the Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing Sonic the Hedgehog, the 1.5 inch. Um, right now we will be reviewing articulations, pros and cons. I mean. Just pros, no cons. Um, uh, sculpt and warnings. For the sculpt, um, or for the first, we're doing box. Um, it says from the hit game. It says its name. It says Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing. On the back, it says Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing. And Sonic the Hedgehog. Um, we will be starting with um articulation. It has four points of articulation in the feet. I mean, in the um wheels of control. Um. And for sculpt, it has good sculpt on the and it has good as you see on the camera. See the nose, how it's skin, and then in the front, it's a dot. It's a dot. That's the problem with the figure. It has good arms, good legs. But you can't remove the figure. Um, starting with pros now. Four points of articulation. No, um, no accessories. It's just, um, uh, just a piece of plastic. You can't remove the figure. Um, it just rolls back and forth. Um, if you compare it to, um, the game, it's not a bad figure looking at the top. Or, um, the reason why I don't like this, this on the vehicle is because they screwed up on the wheels. They don't have any, like, holes in the wheels. They don't have any, um... Letters, holes. Um, then, as you can see, it only has um, the uh, stuff. The, this is just a tremendous vehicle. How they can make it so small and so good. Um, now for the warnings. Um, at Toys R Us, you can get this. And, um, if you want to get it, it's $5 plus tax. And, um, if you really want to, um, get it for, uh, $5. Or, if you want to get it for $1.99 on one of the websites you can get it on, you would, I would rather you get it, um, on one of the websites. Next one I will be reviewing is the Amy. So I'm gonna be uh, posting this one and then I'm going to be uploading this one and then do that one. Really okay. Um, haven't happy to see you next time. See ya.